Meanwhile, in that other controversy, the WeChat and TikTok brouhaha's, a group seemingly unaffiliated with WeChat called the U.S. WeChat Users Alliance, a nonprofit, has filed a lawsuit in district court in San Francisco against President Trump's executive order banning transactions with WeChat and ByteDance. Meanwhile, just this morning, TikTok officially sued the Trump administration in federal court, arguing President Trump's executive order deprived TikTok of due process. Quote, we do not take suing the government lightly. However, we feel we have no choice but to take action to protect our rights and the rights of our community and employees, the company said in its suit. Our more than 1,500 employees across the U.S. pour their hearts into building this platform every day, the company said, noting that it planned to hire more than 10,000 more workers across eight states in the coming years. TikTok argued that the Trump administration, quote, failed to follow due process and act in good faith, neither providing evidence that TikTok was an actual threat nor justification for its punitive actions, the company said in a blog post explaining the grounds for its lawsuit. Further, the company claims that the purported national security threat identified by the Committee on Foreign Investment in the United States were based on, quote, outdated news articles and did not address the documentation provided by TikTok demonstrating the security of user data, end quote. <laughs> 